Hey guys, the Ultimate Gamer 19 here, and welcome to Let's Play The Sims 2 Season 2 Part 18. So, uh, this is not our home, but we moved out to a different home. Uh, so, I packed the stuff that we needed, like Mark and Fiona's portraits, and uh, a few other things as well for moving into this house. So, uh, this is what it looks like on the outside. This is the front, here's the side. <clears throat> And I'm still getting over a cold, so you hear me like cough, or I don't think I'll cough, but just like little sniffles and stuff. Here's the back. You get a little swimming pool and a, a swinging set here. And uh, another side of the house, so that's pretty much it. For, in, for the inside, it's pretty spacious, so that's what I like about it. And uh, yeah, so here's the dining room. I think we'll have to um, move some things and buy new things, so I'll have to cut back in when we do that and I'll show you everything when we when we're back. Alright, uh I'm back and I just finished furnish furnishing furnished furnishing the house a little bit. I actually forgot to move this, hold on. So I wasn't finished completely. Okay, so now I'm finished. Uh, this is what the house looks like. So over here we have uh, Gabriella and Aaron's room. Nothing too special. It's a little bit smaller than their old room at the old house, but this will do. So you have your dresser here with his like space robot toy right there. And then, of course, Gabriella has a freaking chicken on her dresser. <laughs> a chicken versus a space robot or something. So yeah, that's their room. Nothing too special here. It's a kid's room. Twins should never be separated, so of course put their beds here. And then here is the uh, skilling up room where you just learn your skills like cleaning, all that other stuff. Nothing too special. Over here is the sort of a living room, I guess. We have a piano right here and a pool table. Um, a toy house. I didn't buy the toy boxes because they're not going to be children for any longer anyways. It's about three days until the age of into teenagers. Um, of course, little lounging areas. And that is so dangerous, the fireplace right here. And then here's Sam's spots and then Leroy's spot over here because we want them separated because they always fight all the time so what's the point of having them together if you want them to fight all the time. Plus Sam has only a few days left to live so we don't want him to die or anything. This is the living room. I showed you this but uh, yeah more thoroughly. We have Mark and Fiona's paintings over there and uh, just some random paintings on the wall. Like I said I'm still getting over a cold so my voice would be a little funny. And my microphone comes in tomorrow so uh that should be good. And I'll record tomorrow too. Since it's Labor Day where you poop out babies and stuff. <laughs> and then uh, the kitchen is right here. It's really, really nice, I guess. You know, something different. Different style of houses. So this is the kitchen. And then here's the bathroom. It's a really small bathroom. So you can't really see without putting the walls on. Just nothing too special. In the back I showed you already, there was a swimming pool, a swing set, and we, of course, packed up the hot tub and put it there, and then here's Marks and Fiona's graves. I think I should put flowers near them, but I'll do that later. And of course, we should have the snowman boom box right there, of course. And then up onto the upstairs, uh, you have your lift, your exercising room, I guess? Yeah, your exercising room, all the exercise stuff. Um, Scott's and Melissa's room right here. Of course, they brought some of the Bon Voyage stuff with them, like the treasure chest and some other photos from the photo booth and a treasure map, the hidden borrow map from different locations. Of course, painting easel and then some more painting stuff. Violin. Here is Bigfoot's room. It's nothing too special. I don't think I did, but I put any effort into his room. I'll put in a dresser real quick. Sorry, I forget to add stuff. Should I double check before I did this? Yeah, why not? Okay. And then here is uh, Ariana's room right here. Once again, nothing too special. It's just a typical bedroom. And then, of course, I have a little random teddy bear on her computer desk here. Just to show that, like, Tyler cares about her and stuff. And I think she will go to college because we'll definitely go to college with Tyler and them. Let's raise her own family. And I think that's pretty much it of the house tour. Just giving you a little view. And it's a really nice house. It's kind of big, you know, because we have a lot of people with us. 
So let's go ahead and get to the gameplay finally after like six minutes of talking, five minutes of talking. But it's something new, I should, should show you. Of course, when they first move in, everything's gonna be like. Actually, you should, go to, you should go to school. Oh my god, walk to school, walk to school. Walk to school. What the heck? Walk. Where's the walk to school right there? I'm gonna have them walk to school as well. Stop playing with your daddy. Wow, they have issues. Okay. So they're all gonna go walk to school. And I forgot to show you that outside uh, there's a lemonade stand, a telescope, and a little spinny thingy for the children. So they're all going to school. That's good, get them out of the house. I believe Sam has a lot, at least like three more days left to live. I don't know. But it's getting filled up pretty fast. You know where your places are, that's good. They don't have work today, so this could give them a good chance to make some new friends, because uh, you need friends to be promoted. Where's the telephone? I think I put it right there, yeah. Ooh, the dollhouse is in the way. Let's call up some people, and uh, they're both playing, playing pool here. Alright, so we're gonna call up, let's see. Let's call Samantha because we need to raise up some relationship skills here. Oh, she's at work. Samantha. Isn't that- oh, that's Rochelle. I got confused there. Really confused. So she's, she's at work. I have to wait then. Let's go ahead and uh, give some love to Sam. Let's hug him and uh, stroke him. Him get out of your bed. Let's teach him some commands. Let's see. Roll over will be the first command we'll be able to teach him. I think he already knows stay or come here. I think. I think he knows come here. Yeah. Let's play with Sam a little bit, cause, uh, yeah. Oh, Leroy. Even though you're a jerk, you're still cute. Roll over, roll over. Let's take him, let's take Sam for a walk, even though that, yeah, let's take him for a walk. So we're gonna take Sam for a walk, because we never really done that with him before, so we'll do that right now. Of course he's bringing up his fitness, because he's kind of like a little in the middle, out of shape, I guess. So we'll let him work out for a little bit there. I think we'll get him a job, I don't know, he can just be like our maid or something for the house. They're not really getting along well because he's not doing anything. <laughs> so, uh, why don't you make some food for the family? We don't even have any leftovers anymore because it's a different fridge. Let's make some hamburgers. I hate having a, a cold because it makes my voice sound all like congested and stuff. I don't know. It's just ugh, plugged in. turn on some music because it's kind of boring I don't like since I'm sick I probably won't talk a lot so I'll just let you listen to some music while we're doing our thing I have no idea
What kind of songs are these? I don't know. I've never heard them before. He's almost there. He's almost learning it. He's really, really close. Who's that? Oh, our neighbors. Oh, there's a uh, what's his face? Noah, Lewis. Let's go ahead and greet them all. My voice is all weird. Hold on. Okay, 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 okay. Leroy has learned the command roll over. Cool. Let's. Now he's probably tired from learning all that crap. He's gonna go to sleep. I guess. Oh, he's hungry. You're eating out of Sam's pet bowl. How nice. How nice. How nice. Are they still on their walk? Oh, they're still. They came back home. Lisa Ramirez. Let's greet her too. Not just Noah. Ramirez, girl. Ariana is back from school, and so is, I think it's just Ariana, that's it. She brought a friend, what's his name? Sullivan Snid. Cool, you brought a friend. And she's an A-plus student, so yeah. And she will be an, an adult in seven days, but we'll probably get her to college before that happens. Make her a young adult instead. And this thing is glowing, which is really, really cool. So shiny and stuff, it's like glowing. It's really nice. And uh, let's see, I don't have her use our show because she's about to crap her pants. And then we'll do the homework. Actually, no. I'll play some games first. Say with a joke. I don't even know it. Let's talk to Lisa here because she's like someone our age for Melissa. She's Melissa's age, I meant. Someone very mature and everything. Sam has received his pension. Cool, cool. They're not even best friends yet. Dang. I should give. Oh, oh okay. Mr. Mickles. Mr. Mickles. All right, all right, all right. Okay. Let's see, where's the voodoo? Let's be friends. Cause this is the easiest way to make like make friends. Use Mr. Mickles. So you wanna be friends? Yeah. Yep, that should really help them a lot. It really will. I love Mr. Mickles. Sometimes it may backfire, but I only love it when it works. Where's everybody at? Oh, it's right there. Voodoo friendship. Perfect. <laughs> it's gonna work, right? Yep. Wonderful. What about him? Oogie, oogie. Who's that? La Shan Cameron. She looks interesting. Is it gonna work? Yes. So we no longer need friends. I don't think he does either. Yep, we're all pretty good on the friend scale here, so they should be promoted. And uh, they're still eating and talking, jabber, 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 jabber. Why not? Why aren't you eating with them, loner? Ooh, Gabriella made a friend. Came, got a friend from school today. Cool. Where's Aaron at? Oh, he's upstairs. Oh, you're all about to crap yourself. How funny. Draw one down and then use the restroom. A little laggy. That's fine. I guess. 
My mouse is all weird. You're slapping yourself. Cool. Let's listen to a different song because I don't like that song. Always. Pocket full of sunshine. Oh, no. Hot and cold from Katy Perry. How interesting. Stop going to do your homework. that something break whoa <gasps> somebody destroyed a couch and I know who did it Sam oh heck no did Leroy did you do it you butthole oh my god I think damn you they destroyed our couch you can't pick that up either That's stupid. whatever you're cleaning that up but one of our one of our pets like destroyed our couches. I know that for a fact. So why would a Sim do it? And of course, pets like to scratch on stuff and everything. And Sam seems to be like suspicious. Well, we're suspicious about Sam, but ugh, screw you, pets. Where's that couch at? I don't know where it is. Is that his? Yeah, right here. I think we had it in the green color as well. We should have scolded them. I don't know who to scold though. We can't anymore. That is nasty. You should not eat that anymore. You're gonna get food poisoning. Stop eating it, you little nasty. Clean that up. Clean it up. Clean it up. Aaron has the opportunity to enter college before moving into college. Aaron can use a computer or phone to apply for scholarships. Yeah, I think you should get going home too, little kid. Just almost done with their homework here. Gonna have Aaron do his homework as well, and Gabriella. Children, children, children. Two more days until they age up. Uh, I don't know how long I'll be recording. I'm kind of sick, so that kind of reduces the time limit here. But we'll see. But we'll see. Hey, I found some new places to hang out at downtown. Do you want to meet me there? Who? Who's that? I don't want to. Reject that. Uh, let's go ahead and have uh, Ariana sneak out tonight. Probably no. But let's have permission to go out. Can we do that? Have a date for, for Tyler and uh, Ariana. Hmm. But let's see what we can do. Alright, let's see where is Tyler at. Let's invite him over. No? Can't we go on a date with him or something? Let's try. Whatever, I don't know. She needs some social love, so her boyfriend is a good social raiser, I guess. There's a skunk on our lawn. No! Get out of here. And I bet if we try to pet it, it'll probably spray us and make her nasty. Stinky. Go away, go away. Where's Tyler? He should be over here. Yeah. 
Hello there, baby. Mm. <laughs> oh, somebody. I don't know. Oh, they're best friends. Yeah. Propose him to sleep over. Ooh, go steady. Well, let's go steady with him. Let's go steady. Yeah. Mm. Steady. He's like, oh, you do the best backups in the world. Of course I do. I am an Anderson. You gonna be my boyfriend? <laughs> Yay, they're they're steady. What next? What steady? Yeah. Can I sleep over? He's like, sure. Let's buy an extra bed for like a little guest bed in Ariana's room. You never know what they could do. Bounce, go wow wow. <laughs> Where's the bed? Oh, it's right there. Should we buy a double bed? Both of them sleep in. No, that's too nasty. They're pretty young for that. Too young for that. They can sleep really close, though. Sort of close, yeah. Have you ever been handcuffed by the government? He's like, yeah, yeah. Oh, that's a joke. Cuddle under the stars, ooh. More romantic. Mm, love it. Oh, what the heck? She—he's supposed to be. Do, she's supposed to be doing that to him. Don't you be touching that part. That is so nasty. Ew. You are stinky, like a mother trucker. Stop complaining, you delinquents. Go to sleep. Why can't you? Can you go downstairs? Hopefully, they can go downstairs. Oh wait, that wrong bed. Wrong bed. I'm pausing it so they don't do anything stupid. Okay, I thought they were stuck up there because they were whining like little pansies. But they're going to sleep. I think Bigfoot is just like, oh my gulai. Melissa, if Scott were to see you sleeping with Bigfoot, he would freaking throw you out the window. Maybe she's giving him payback or something. But Scott's is, I don't know. He hasn't been flirtatious lately, so mm, maybe he's controlling you after all. Yeah. We should have bought a phone upstairs, so we'll have to do that right now. I keep forgetting to do things, I'm sorry. I am so sorry. But Bigfoot seemed to enjoy it. He's like, ooh, I have a girl with me in the bed. We should get him a lover too, because he is Bigfoot and he will be an elder in 25 days. So let's try and find him a lover as well. This is so romantic. Ooh. No. That guy doesn't look too bad. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. But I think they're all gonna go to bed. Go ahead and go to sleep. It's like, do you see that? Do you see that thong right there? I'm gonna wear that whenever we go into bed together. <laughs> Alright, that's enough. That's enough. You two need to go to bed. Actually, I'm gonna have to go eat something real quick. Serve up some dinner for your lover. Mm. Let's fill the pet bowls real quick because we don't want them starving or anything like that. So, yeah. It's nasty. Clean that up too. So that should conclude today. We should end the part here. Uh, that should conclude today's episode of Let's Play The Sims 2 uh, Season 2 Bottom Rash Slash Free Time Part 18. Uh, if you like the video, go ahead and click the like button. If you want to continue watching this series, why not subscribe if you haven't already? Um, yeah, all of you have a wonderful. Hopefully, hopefully, all of you had a wonderful weekend. And um, I will be recording tomorrow. Of course, I have no school tomorrow. It's Labor Day, where you will be able to poop out babies. So see you guys. I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Y'all have a 
awesome day. Hopefully you had a good weekend, and uh, thanks for watching, guys.